Hey, welcome back to uh, Richmond Comics YouTube channel. Well, I'm just kind of throwing this all under the RCX Unfiltered that we do on Tuesdays live. But this is another unboxing, or, well, it's a finishing, hopefully, of the unboxing that we started with the Proton Pack. You can probably kind of see, let's see here, go over there, see the box from the Proton Pack. We'll bring that back over here and bring it up a little bit. There we go. Sure. Now we're going to do the wand. So we're going to unbox the wand, get this unboxed, get it connected to this proton pack, and see how they work together. So once again, this is all from Hasbro, HasLab, um, what they've put out. They did put out the wand first. Um, so had the wand but then they did the proton pack, but I really haven't done anything with the wand. I did go ahead and take it out of the big brown box, like everything else. If you watch the unboxings a lot of times, these are well packed, well shipped. So, and I did make things easier for me at the beginning of this. I went ahead and, and cut the tape here, but we'll go ahead and get started. So, so it comes with a nice little sleeve. You can see some of the Ghostbuster stuff on the back. And so it's neutron wand. Looks like a case similar to what we got there. So let's see here. We'll open this up. Well, and there's wow. So that's what it looks like inside the box. So we've got that going for us. It's all squeaky. Squeaky, squeaky, squeaky. All right. So let's see here what we have. Let's pull, let's pull these out. So I guess they're first little pieces to connect to everything. I guess pieces to hook into the wand. So lots of those little pieces. Here we'll kind of lay these out back here so you can see them in a little bit. Let's see if we can get this wand out of here. Well, you know, nothing's ever easy. Nothing, nothing's ever easy. Stop. There we go. Got the wand out. Got, got a plate piece here. Let's see what this looks like. Uh, stand. Wand stand, we'll throw that over there. We probably won't be using that. Get rid of some of these pieces. We've got the booklets. Don't care about that. Got the booklet that comes with it. And explains everything. So all these pieces here are set up for the, uh, it looks like to put the stand on the wand or the wand on the stand yeah 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 you know that makes easy yeah so that's all the extra pieces in case you want to just get the wand so let's see if we can get these out these out of these pieces here wow it's really in there let's see yeah. there we go rip that let's see what we got up here don't want to mess up the wiring there. So, like I said, all these things are always packed really well. I'm sure I could have pulled some of that stuff out, but that's okay. So, yeah, let's now we'll get the. Oh, it's not a, it's not a metal tie. Sorry. This is what happens when you do these unboxings. You never know what is uh, holding these things together. And of course, I didn't bring my knife, you know, because that's why I cut the box ahead of time. It's because I didn't think I'd need my knife. Ah! <laughs> All right, I'm losing this fight. I'm losing, I'm losing this fight. There we go. Get that out of the way. So here we go. So we have the wand, all 
all the switches, buttons, well, oh, that one works. That one is not. I guess that's for hook. I, I, I have to read the book. I did not read the manual, so, you know. Plus, I just opened it. Now, nah, I've lost the manual, too. There it is. I'll figure it out. So, we'll get this box out of the way over there. So, now, if I remember correctly, I need my screwdriver again. So, let's see if we can't get this out. Maybe, maybe not. Huh. Things don't ever seem to work like you would want them to work, right? Because you got to get this piece out. Of course, I can't see. So. That's great. Let's see what we have here. So basically, <laughs> we got to get this little piece out here to be able to and there's all kind of little things here. Let's see here. Where's my book? To make sure I'm doing this correctly. But you know, it wouldn't be the uh, first time. Hey, look, I need a screwdriver to get this out. And I thought I had one, but I guess I was wrong. There we go, look at that. So now we can unscrew this, because now we need to pull this out. So if you don't have a backpack or a proton pack, you can put uh, three AA batteries in here, slide it back in, screw this back in, and you'll be able to boot this up. But we are planning to sit there and use the proton pack with this. So we will put this off to the side don't think I messed up anything there with that. Let's get this over there. Get our little ghosties out of the way. Or ghosties, marshmallow people. And slide this on up so everybody can see it a little bit better. You care more about this than seeing me. So we're going to now attach this. So you'll still be seeing me. So we have the backpack here. Remember, the proton pack came with the connector. And so, remember, and the wand came with this for batteries. So, the hose comes with a piece looking just like it, but it has the two connectors on the end that should correlate to these. And it's going to pull the power from the D batteries that we put in here. And... I did a quick little video on the batteries on this and boot it up and I'll put that down below. But now we're gonna connect all of this. First, we will connect it here and get this done. So there we go. So we got that hooked up and let's see here. Can you see it without my leg being in the way? So here we go. So we got this piece and it did a good job with the uh, rubber piece on the hose to make it expand. But let's see here. Let's see if we can't figure out. Here, let me pick this up. Hopefully you can kind of see. Connector. Ah, oh, look at that. So, well, let's all this tightened kind of sort of all right so now let's set this back in here with this we're going to bring this back to the front you can see with the wand here it's got activate all kind of little buttons here activate intensify Power buttons here, but we haven't turned the power on to the proton pack. So we're going to turn the proton pack power on. 
and then we'll see and there we go see it's all lit up see if we can turn it down turn the volume down some Oh, it's vibrating now. So now that it's finally got the power going to it. And look at that, the Activate actually turned the, uh, the backpack off on that. So now we can So we're getting a little bit more vibrating there. So we can adjust the vibration of the wand. I mean, I, I know you can't feel the vibration of the wand. I'm just kind of, you may be able to hear it. So we got different sounds, different colors that's coming out of it. And that's the intensify. So overall, let's see. I turned the activate off. And then now the backpack is turned off. So it does, you can get it to control this while you're playing with it. See, now it's booting back up. Activate was on. So I turn it off, turn off activate. And then it turned this off. So, and now, like I said, you don't have to do the if you only get the wand, you can just have it, set it on the stand with your three AA batteries and you can run all the power. But if you have the proton pack, this is how the proton pack is going to connect to this. Um, and the other thing is to see you got the uh, metal plate here. So if we turn this back around, you'll notice the metal plate here. Let me lift you up a little bit. You'll notice the metal plate here, so you always have your, well, I've got my hose jumbled, but we'll figure all that out later. And then, so there you go. So now you have your full, let me slide this back some, your full backpack. So when you put it on, you just reach, pull up, when you get ready, it just goes down and I'm now sure you're, and I hit my watch. So she's not really sure why I'm doing this, but nah, are any of us? So, and let's see here, can I? So we can boot it up there, get the activate. And so now the wand is ready, backpack is ready. So if you're a big Ghostbusters fan and you know, you really want to have a really nice backpack. Um, there's plenty of things online of building your own backpack and all that stuff. But if you want to get something that's really well built, really well done with the sounds, the wands, the connections and everything, this uh, HazLab one, and it just shuts down after a while. So look at that. Here, we're going to turn it off now. So it's turned off here from the switch that's over here. So even if I was to try to do anything now here, it, oh, it did. So even when it's turned off here, it's, it's reversing this power switch now. So that's very interesting. So that is really cool. So basically now with the wand connected, you're reversing this power switch here. So I guess technically 
it actually does not control much of anything now because this is overriding the uh that well no it didn't that time so once i turned it back on and then back off it overrode the whole thing so let's see here now it's off off so it once again is overriding the off switch which is pretty neat And we've got the activate going. So there's, like I said, there's the different modes. Once again, if you saw from, uh, if you go back and look at the battery installation video, which is five or six minutes long, it's probably longer than that because I ramble a very, very lot. Um, you got two different settings in here, or technically you have two settings. There's a motor in here for vibration. So you can turn that on and off, or you have um, original proton pack, you have afterlife, you have afterlife proton pack. And then once this is connected, as you're seeing, this is controlling all of this to, uh, actually turn off. So now everything I've turned off everything here and now I can't get it out. Oh, there we go. And it's got a hook there. So I guess you can hook it wherever you like. So once again, yeah, this is a, uh, no, I can't, there we go. This is like really well built, really well done. Um, I do have a Ghostbuster suit that I'll be wearing this year, probably for free comic book day and some after, uh, done by Geeky Pierre. So that'll be pulled out. So if you come by the shop then, or we'll probably post some stuff on here with the full functioning pack later on with me in suit and stuff, but it'd be further down the line. So there you go. So that is the full unboxing of both pieces of the Hasbro HasLab Proton Pack and wand or Neutrino Rond, Neutrino Rond, wand, Whew. words. I'm very difficult having a hard time with words, but so this is the whole setup, the whole wand, this is everything they got. It comes with a stand. I will find a nice place for this as I will probably never use the batteries in that along with the stand. But, you know, I don't get rid of a whole lot. So it'll probably just go back into the box and get put in my garage. So, and then this will be put up. So, and then below this one, I'll do, I'll put the link for the uh, unboxing for the full pack and for the battery installation when we initially played with the sounds and kept taking this off and doing some of that so once again thanks a lot thanks for joining me on this uh unboxing i hope you like it if you do please subscribe to our channel as we do more of these um and we'll be doing a lot more different unboxings and things for the shop um and then like this video follow the little bell don't smash stuff though that seems very very uh destructive to uh, electronic equipment. So thanks a lot. Thanks for joining me. We'll talk to you next time. Out.